hi, hello, chat. What the fuck? Um, <laughs> Malvo, Kaisen, Divinity, good to see you. Mike, thank you for the 31 months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hi, Bonge, hi, Dear Cannon, hi, Jaster. Hi, Johnny, Falcon, thank you for the 62 months. Holy shit. Um, hi, Waffle. Leo, oh, oh Hi, hello, Leo. <laughs> Leo, thank you for the 44 months. I appreciate it. Hi, Azekard, happy Sunday. John, how are you? Thank you for the bits. Hello, hello, hello. You guys doing okay? Hold on, I'm not comfy yet. Hey, frog. Hold on. Boss. You guys have a good weekend? Oh my god. I'm stuck. Somebody help. Ah! It's okay. Ugh. Oh. Hi, Amelia. How am I? I'm struggling, Waffle. <laughs> I'm struggling. I'm doing much better than last week. That's, that's good. That's really, really good. Hi. Well, come here. Come here. Did you guys hear that? Hi, Tom. You're tired, you're not ready for the week? I'm kind of tired too. My headache's gone though. I want her to come down and say hello. Could actually barely- Yeah, she's being really fucking loud, but she's like upstairs. <laughs> she's, she's like up a floor. Um, so like you shouldn't be able to hear her at all. Hi, Dorothor. Hi, Kaino. Hello, hello. There's a camera in there? I know, she's so camera shy. Come here. You can't. I can hear. I can hear her playing with something. I can hear her running around. Come here. She's been running around with her avocado. <laughs> she has. She has a little avocado toy that she carries around in her mouth. And she meows, and it's really fucking cute. Did you guys have a good weekend? How are you? Happy Sunday. I will. I will stop looking for my cat. I'm here. You reinstalled Fallout 4 because they're updating it. Wait, what are they? What are they doing to Fallout 4? What are they, What are they doing? I think Fall. I think I have Fallout 4 for my Xbox. I'm pretty sure. My Xbox. One. I think it came with my Xbox One. I'm pretty sure when I bought it. New gen upgrade. Hi vlog. Try your lick. The sh the show is pretty good. Yeah, yeah. I've been I've been watching it. Are you guys watching the Fallout show? It's pretty it's pretty good actually. I like it. Add in a little bit of DLC, some character creation. That's some modern made. Wait, they're officially adding a character creation? Hi, Thundy. That's rude. What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, I guess it's not really that rude. You haven't yet? It's definitely on your list. It's good. It's really good. I don't know anybody. Um. I don't know anybody that's watched the show that doesn't like the games. Has anybody in chat watched the show and not played the games? Because I'm really, really liking the show. I think it's great. Um, but I don't know how I would feel if I didn't know the Fallout franchise. Because part of what I love so much about it is like I loved the games in general, and they did such a good job with it, and like turning it into a show. 
Dragoonies, are you watching it? Also, hi. You've played some? Show's perfect? Yeah. Had one of your coworkers ask you about it? She and her husband watch it. They enjoyed it too. Oh, they haven't played any of the games. Oh, they, they still liked it. Oh, interesting. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I don't really expect much for the show. Yeah, me neither. Yeah, I honestly, if I'm if I'm being honest, which I always am. We don't lie here. Um I thought it was gonna be terrible. <laughs> if, we're, if we're being honest. I, I thought it was gonna be terrible. Hi, Lofin! Talking about Fallout, yeah, yeah, yeah. Brother has no clue what the game is, loves the show. Oh, that's really cool. That's really cool then. Same, totally fair. Yeah, yeah, I thought, I thought it was gonna be, I thought it was gonna be bad. I thought it was gonna be bad. Exactly, as a crane, like most shows or movies based <laughs> based on games, especially one as big as Fallout. Both in terms of like the fan base and the scope of the game. Um, why am I already starting shit? I didn't do anything. What the fuck? I'm just over here minding my own business. Not doing anything. Someone knew that they couldn't fuck this one up. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, they, they definitely put a lot of effort into it and it shows. Like the, the set design alone is so fucking good. Like so good. Hi, Theta. Do you think it'll work well the same? Yeah. Does it follow the main story? That's true, that's true. The soundtrack is great, the show really replicates the feel of the game. Yes. Yes. The the set design and the feel of of the show is like exactly the same as the game. It's so cool. It's so cool. They made a twisted metal show? I don't think I've ever watched that. Or played or played the games. The main character actress said she played the games as part of her research for the role. I want to be a an actor that gets cast in something where you get to just play video games as research. <laughs> like, okay, yeah, yeah, I'm I'm doing this as research. You know? Hi, Uplica. How's your night going? They watched Twitch to research the roles too. No, they didn't, did they? I'm just gonna assume you're lying to me. Has it been renewed for a second season yet? I don't know if it has officially, but I would be very surprised if it wasn't. Be very surprised if it wasn't. You know. <laughs> Oh, it has been renewed already. It has been renewed. It got renewed for season two before before it premiered. What? How? Why? How does how does that work? <laughs> I don't understand. Like the day before, I don't understand. Sometimes shows come out and they do really well and they get like fucking canceled and then sometimes they get renewed before they even air. What? Why? No? Good thing it's on Amazon. If it was on Netflix, it'd be, it'd be canceled by now, Falcon, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, Greg. The book they get to watch before it airs me. Wait, really? How do you get that job? How do you get that job? If it's a hit, they'll renew it into the ground? You would think so, but that doesn't seem to be the case anymore. I've heard that there's like a... Um, there's like a resurgence of people watching like old shows lately. 
It's like younger younger people apparently are watching shows that are like 10, 15 years old. And it's like, yeah, because everything now gets fucking canceled. <laughs> they're looking they're looking for shows where it's like they get like a full story. You know? Um, Falcon, thank you for gifting us up the Implica. Thank you. That's very kind. They don't give about how popular it actually is, just how well it hits or whatever. Be a critic or producer? You need money for that, don't you? <laughs> don't you need? What does a producer do? Hi, Vega. What does a producer do? That's your problem with anime, it rarely gets more than one season. Is that true? I just started watching anime recently, so I'm only watching like all like the really well-known stuff. You don't know what a producer does? Does anybody? I don't think anybody does. They should watch Firefly. That is, that is one show I really, really like Firefly, but I really fucking hope they never bring it back. It's too late at this point. They would just ruin it. You know? It's like, do not bring back Firefly. Name thyself. Don't do it. Stranger. <laughs> leave it alone. <laughs> just leave it alone. Um, TP, thank you for the raid. How are you? How was your stream? Welcome in, Raiders. Hello, hello. Hi, Dulce. Hi, Lucifer. Hi, TP. How are you guys? Welcome, welcome. Hi, JC. Happy Sunday. We're talking about the, the Fallout show. We're talking about the Fallout show. He wants to retire. Leave the man alone. Does he want to retire, though? He's still in stuff, isn't he? You're on vacation! Oh my god, he flies to Scotland tomorrow? Fucking jealous, man. Oh man, you're gonna have so much fun, holy shit. How long are you going for? 10 days? Two weeks? Can't remember. I feel like you told me. Um, Falcon! Falcon, thank you for gifting us up. Thank you, thank you. That's very kind. That's gonna be so much fun. Yeah. Yeah, that's gonna be amazing. I'll be there five nights. Um. That's really cool. So jealous. So jealous. I've never been to Scotland. I do want to go. You miss some. Um, how was how was Baldur's Gate today? You're in, you're in Act Three now, right? You're like way ahead of me. I'm still in Act One technically. I haven't played in a really long time though. <laughs> it's been it's been a while. Gonna miss Vincent though. Who's watching him for you? He's gonna miss you so much. Oh man, I can't I can't wait to hear what he does when you get back. My cats are always so funny when I go away and then come back. Let's go to Scotland. Let's do it, chat. Take him to the vet for, for boarding. They'll take really good care of him there. Hi, shirt cake. Scotland is nice, just to study abroad there, and the whole family had to go help her bring luggage back for 10 days. I wanna go. I wanna go, I wanna go. I wanna go, Jack. I wanna go. Hi, Mike Jones! Happy Sunday. Don't wanna burden anyone to clean his ears, that's fair. Yeah, that's fair. Um. No shower beers, Waffle. No shower beers. Why not? A deep fried Mars bar? Is that a thing that they have there? I saw that on a menu somewhere recently. Where did I fucking see that? I saw that recently. Bum, 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 bum. 
I can miss keep the grass so green. Hold on, I'm all twisted. Be back in a bit though. Sounds good. Sounds good. Ooh, chat! Exciting news! Kinda, maybe. Maybe you won't be excited. I was excited. <laughs> I've officially, um, actually, no way, not officially. Unofficially, but officially in progress. Um, have unlocked a YouTube partner. Wait, <laughs> wait, sell it, yeah. <laughs> that, yeah, yeah. Like, um, so I, I hit the, I hit the watch hours. Like, just so there's, there's two, there's two things. There's like a first step and a second step. So I got I got the first step. I got the first step. Um, so now they, they just have to like review it, which they said could like take up to a month. Um, and then I need, I need more watch hours and like a handful of subscribers, I think, to get the, the second one. So that's pretty, pretty exciting. Medium excited. Kaido, yeah, me and excited. It's not, it's not actually set up yet on YouTube because they're still reviewing it, but I was pretty excited. I was pretty excited. I got my three months of PP points. I don't, no. No, I do not have that. <laughs> no, not yet. I should, I should hopefully, unless something crazy happens this month, um, I should have the first, the first one, you know, the one that, the one that gives me 60, 40, but that's new. So like the first month you can actually get that is next month. And so like I had it in February, March, and then this month will be the last one. set up some playlists on loop yeah <laughs> yeah it's been um i don't know it's been it's been cool to do something new with the with the youtube stuff yeah my youtube stuff yeah yeah yeah, yeah. um yeah that's pretty exciting your friend is from scotland she was on the crown oh i love the crown yeah i love that show i watched outlander as well for a couple seasons I don't think I ever finished it though. Let's get watched. I would appreciate that. Yeah, that'd be very, very nice. Yeah, I just finished. I th I think the last video I posted was um the the last one of Mass Effect One. I finished putting those up. Hi, Kaiser. Outlander's nice, the episodes are, are too long for you. Outlander... I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> I don't know how to describe it. You know? It's like, I watched it, I watched it a really long time ago. It was like a, it was like a guilty pleasure. Where I was like, this is, this is terrible, but... I also really like it. You know? Each episode's like an hour long. Are they- are they that long? And they're probably long seasons too, right? Is it like a 20 episode season? I think I gave up on that show around the fourth season. I can't remember why, but this the story started going in a direction where I was like, yeah, I'm not really interested anymore. That's really cool, Johnny. You know a lot of people in show business. Do you know any producers? Hi, Jeff. Also, do you guys remember anything about this game? I remember... I remember cutting off body parts <laughs> with, 
with a with a cleaver. Nodders, nodders. Two point five, yeah. Yeah, yeah, two point five. Two and a half. And you can hide under stuff. And it was pretty cool. I remember being cool too. Yeah. Sounds cozy. It's very cozy. Yeah, there's there's like demons and ghosts, zombies. You hack off their body parts and give them to a witch. She makes you stronger. <laughs> nice and nice and cozy, right? <laughs> Remember a guy crawling inside a bag and it called it a worm? He was a worm, Leo! <laughs> he, was, he was a worm! Um, God of Gamers, thank you! Thank you so much for the 17 months. That's very kind. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How are you? How's your Sunday going? That guy fucked us up? Yeah! Yeah! You're seeing things? No, it was definitely a worm, not a guy crawling inside a bag. Yeah, you're definitely seeing things and I'm not gaslighting you. Smile. <laughs> but fuck those worms, man. They're too they're too strong. They're too strong. Bum, 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 bum. I think we're gonna start. We're gonna play this tonight, see how it goes. See if that date. <laughs> That's not just you! That date doesn't want to talk to me anymore. He's gone quiet. He's gone quiet. But yeah, it's not it's not just that date. <laughs> and the the target changes. The target changes. I had something else to tell you guys. What else am I gonna tell you? What else did I do this weekend? Not sure if that helps any though. He'll probably say it doesn't help. No, no. Hi, Perp! How's your day going? When did I play this last Tuesday? Wait, I didn't stream on Thursday. Guys, I had a fucking headache for like three days. And I don't know why. I think it was weather related. Cause it like rained for like four days straight. But holy shit, I was like, I was dying last week. Did you hate those types of headaches? Yeah. Yeah, like it, nothing, nothing could like cut through it. It was, it was just there like behind this eye. I am feeling better today, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you get those two, they suck. Do you ever like push on the side of your nose? <laughs> when you have those headaches, not just randomly. Did I drink too much coffee? Did I not drink enough coffee? No, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't change my coffee intake. No, I don't know. I don't know what it was. I was probably dehydrated a little bit, and then I think the the pressure. We had like a crazy storm on. Two, we had a crazy storm on Tuesday, and then Wednesday was like really hot. It was like 18 degrees, and then it rained for like three days straight. So I think it was like the pressure changes. Push inside your nose, you don't get headaches. No, like when you when you have a headache, and you push right here, it like it fixes it, but only only like temporarily. Like as you're doing it, it goes away. Do you remember to you? You press in the corners of your eyes. Yeah, yeah, like in here. Yeah, it was like behind this eye, and when I would push on the side of my nose, it would go away. But then you're just sitting there doing that, which is less painful, but equally as annoying <laughs> as, having, <laughs> as having a headache. A new level of random questions. Yes, yes. Oh my God, Jazzer. Fuck, man. Like. When I'm editing these playthroughs and listening to all my bullshit, so the last, the, the last, the 
video I edited was the one that's out now, which is the last episode of Mass Effect 1. And, um, that was the night that I stalled for an hour and a half before we started playing. And then like 45 minutes at the end. Hi, Ravad! And it was like a four hour stream. It was also the night that I, I told everybody about the spider. But I usually like watch through the start of it to just grab like little snippets as like a little like intro thing. But man, I was, I was like all over the fucking place. <laughs> just jumping from one thing to the next, you know? Hi, Damon. How's it going? Welcome in. That was a, it was a very chaotic stream. Very chaotic, yeah, which is unusual around here. <laughs> Could be eye strain too. You know what? You're probably right. Lucifer, yeah, you're you're probably right. I know that I need to get my eyes checked. I wear contacts. I I wear contacts and um my contacts and my glasses are different prescriptions. Hi, hi nights. Did I say hi? I don't remember. Welcome in. And my glasses are older. And I think I've been wearing my glasses for a couple days. And I start to get headaches. But even my contacts, I think, aren't right anymore. Um, Because I haven't had them checked in a couple years. So I feel like I need to get them updated. Unusual. Unusual. Yeah. It's unusual for things to be chaotic. <laughs> Usually I'm very calm, collected. You know? Sounds like it's time. Time for what? What are we doing? What, what time? Stalling time? Bum, 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 bum. Me and Chaotic? No way, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Always calm and collected here in this channel. Nothing, <laughs> nothing chaotic ever happens here. <laughs> That's a great thing for the fans. <laughs> Thank you. Nothing chaotic. No. No, just Sesame Street. Um, Thank you. Time to update my prescription. Oh, yes. Yeah, I should do that. I don't know where to go though. My sure I'm putting contacts over contacts in my eye. What? No, that's crazy. No, I definitely haven't done that. Sometimes though, um, if I'm really tired. <laughs> Sometimes if I'm really tired. I go to take out my contacts and I've already taken them out. And so I just like poke myself in the eye. And I get confused as to why I didn't get a contact, so I do it again. <laughs> like I'll do it. I'll do it more than once. <laughs> And then I'm like, oh, oh yeah, I already took it out. <laughs> Glad you're not the only one, Blam. Yeah, yeah. Um, uh huh. Let's try the uh, yeah. Let's try the other eye. Yeah. <laughs> You've done that before too, Azagrid. Do you do it more than once? It happens. Yeah, because some, sometimes, sometimes, like, sometimes they get, like, a little bit stuck. If your eyes are really dry and you're, like, you're really tired, you know? I never had contacts in yet. 
Here's a disposable too. You took them out and threw them in the trash already. You don't have anybody to know for sure. Oh, yeah, see my mine, mine are mine are monthly. Um so I can I can usually see that they're already in the case. But sometimes my mind is elsewhere, thinking of other things. Put them both both in the other one. Like in the in the case. You'll never use contacts. Why? It's not that bad. What, Balvo? The lady that had like 17 pairs of contacts that she forgot about? Like all of them? In her eyes? On her eyes? confess. I'm gonna confess. This is a confession. Confession time. As a kid, that's what happened to me. So, in university, in first year, I slept in them more times than I should. <laughs> Usually, alcohol was involved and I fell asleep. Um, and, <laughs> and I woke up and I, uh, I didn't have a contact in the sign. I was like, oh, okay, whatever. I lost it. So I put another one in, but I kept being, like, my eye was really irritated and it kept bothering me. And I kept feeling like I had like an eyelash somewhere. And I, like, I was literally like, I was like holding open my eyelid and like staring in the mirror and like moving my eye and stuff and I was like there's not like there's nothing in my eye I was like there's something in my eye but there's nothing in my eye um and that went on for like like a week <laughs> like a really long time um yeah, like five or six days. Not like a, like a couple hours. Like it was like, it was fucking days. It was close to a week. And then eventually it came out and it was all like, it was just folded up. And it came out in like the corner of my eye. Cause I kept fucking like moving my eyelid around and stuff. And I'm like, there's something in there. Um, and it must've been like folded up like behind my eye or something. I don't fucking know. Just how? But I was more careful with them after that. <laughs> I, was, I was more careful. It finally worked its way out though. Yeah. Yeah. My eye decided to take matters in his own hands. Yes. It's a learning story. It is. Yeah. It's with the falling asleep with them in. Falling asleep with your contacts in is the fucking worst. Cause then like you wake up and they're like stuck to your eye. They get so dry. You know? Yeah. Such an inspirational story. <laughs> Fuck man. You googled it, and apparently it wasn't 17. It was 27. Moral of the story? Oh, there's so many there. Um, we could, we could, we could, uh, we could list them all and then pick one. Moral of the story: Don't binge drink. Also, don't sleep in your contacts. Um. Also, if you think there's something in your eye, maybe go to a doctor. Um, what else we got, chat? <laughs> what, what else? What else should we learn from this? So many layers, yeah. <laughs> so many layers. So 
a message. <laughs> yeah, I didn't notice I had one of those. Yep, hi Odin. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, balls. Fuck it, it's fine. I also... I don't know if I told you guys this one. Did I tell you guys? And again, this was like a really long time ago. Like, this was in high school. So both these stories happened... Like, how old am I? <laughs> both of these stories happened like over 15 years ago here we go again this one's not as bad it's not as bad more understandable i had um we're still, <laughs> we're still stalling i was telling chad about the time i lost a contact in my eye for like six days tp it was folded up behind my eyeball um i also had like this really intense pain on the end of my finger for like a like a really long time like a really really long time like every everything I would like touch would be like ow like that fucking hurts and I would I would keep looking at it and I was like trying to see if there was something like in my finger it was like nothing no matter what I did it was like do I have something like stuck in there like what the fuck is going on it looked perfectly normal but this went on for I don't know three or four days approximately um and I couldn't figure out why it was so sore and why it hurt so much but it looked perfectly fine I had a nail inside my nail no I had a piece of hay I had a sliver like a piece of hay but like straight into my finger not like under the skin so you couldn't see it but it was like it was like this long And it was like, no, it was like right, right in like the tip of my finger. Um, TP, thank you for the tier three for 45 months. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate that. Hi, Huntington. That's a new one. Yeah. Yeah, no, it, it wasn't on the fingernail. Like it was in like the fleshy part, the, the tip of my finger. And I just kept picking at it. Cause I was like, why does it hurt so much? And then I eventually, eventually like I just kept squeezing it and just went, Ooh. <laughs> and it just came like straight out. But it took days, it took fucking days. And I was like, okay, I'm not insane. There was a giant sliver in my finger for, for a very long time. Um, Hair can do that too, Spur? Oh, that's terrifying. But that was when I worked at the farm. Right, so I was, I was like moving hay bales around all day. The sound <laughs> it sounded exactly like that, Knights, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've heard straw can be sharp as a needle? No, she heard anything like that before? Yeah, no, it, like that's the only time it's happened. Popped right in there, but after after like being in my finger for like three or four days. Get a banana peel on your finger now. Oh, that sounds painful. Garlic sauce money. Oscar and de la Renta! Garlic thank sauce you. Fashion. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for the $20. That's very kind. Thank you. Helping fund my, my garlic sauce addiction. I appreciate that. Very kind. Popped right out of there, yeah. Yeah. I I fucking hate splinters though, but I'm good at um I remember for some reason my dad teaching me when I was little how to get a splinter out. And he would like disinfect like a needle and show me how to like how to get it out using that. Um, so I'm actually really good at it. Like, I'm really, really good at getting splinters out. Um, but I didn't know this one was a splinter. Because it was just straight in. It was just straight in. You once had a glass shot in your foot for like two years? 
maybe three years. Without tweezers? Sometimes I use tweezers. Sometimes I use tweezers, but like it's helpful to have like a little pin. I remember I was at a friend's house once. There were a bunch of people there actually. This wasn't that long ago. <laughs> it wasn't that long ago, but one of my close friends, he had a really bad, bad splinter. And he was complaining about it. About how much it hurt. And I was like, let me get it out for you. He's like, no, 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 no. He was like, he was like freaked out. He's like, no. He's like, I don't, he's like, it, it's, it's too painful. He's like, I just, he's like, no. And I was like, it's okay. I'm really good at it, I promise. And he's like, no, I don't, no, just, I'm, like, he was just, he was being a baby. <laughs> he was being a baby. And I was like, just trust me, just trust me, I can do it. And so, I, I did it, and, um, and, uh, the whole time he was, like, so scared. And he was very impressed. And he was like, how the fuck did you just do that? He's like, that didn't hurt at all. And I was like, yeah, I know what I'm doing. I've done this before, you know? <laughs> but this one, a piece of hay, that was a different story. Such a supportive friend, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had to, like, I had to, like, talk him through it. <laughs> I, had to, I had to talk him through it, like, calm him down. This was, like, a... How old were we at the time? Like, a 32-year-old man. I'm like, it's okay. Trust me. It's not gonna hurt. And he was somebody that like I didn't I didn't expect that from him. He's a, he's a pretty like he's like a hockey bro, you know. But for whatever reason, like the splinter was just like a really big deal. <laughs> Use a razor blade? I don't I don't think I could do that. I don't think I could do that. Put pins, pins and loose skin on your fingers. Oh, like, where? What loose skin? Razors can work too. I'm just picturing like... <laughs> no. <laughs> no, that sounds scary. That sounds scary. Tell us about this game before I play it. There's monsters. And you're in a dream world? And you're harvesting body parts, and you're tr it's kind of like a mystery. We don't really know what's going on yet. You like your fingers? Me too. Me too, me too. You used to bite your nails. The bad and create loose skin near your, oh, near your cuticles. Oh. This is a wholesome game. Yeah, this is a game that you should recommend to all your baby friends. <laughs> Pretty sure is what we decided last time. You should recommend this game to your baby friends. Welcome in Jack. English only in chat, please. If I don't speak any other languages. was an odd time. Do you guys ever, um, when you were a kid, did you ever dip your fingers in wax? <laughs> My mom always had candles. She always had candles. And I always liked dipping my fingers in the wax, even though it hurt. It was it was kind of it was kind of painful if it was hot. I never burnt my fingers or anything. But then you let it dry. And glue? It was more fun with candles for some reason. I thought it was cool, it was cool. It always reminded me of The Simpsons though. You guys know when he goes to the the chili cook off and he drinks the candle? <laughs> I know TP knows. <laughs> Miss the chili cook-off. 
<laughs> then they're just throw yeah. Yeah, so we can eat the really hot peppers. And hallucinate. As long as you're not stepping the glue. Do you remember do you guys remember those um the the markers they made? That had scents? And they smelled really good. Why were they encouraging kids to to smell markers? <laughs> what was the thought process there? The nice smelling markers, yeah. Because they were doing it anyways. <laughs> to sell more markers. <laughs> they made them smell good and not toxic, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We don't remember those. It sounds like a like a bad idea. I remember having them. Like the banana, the banana one. I remember having like a like a set of them. <laughs> and so you think they made bank on that? Yeah, they probably did. <laughs> they probably did. I don't think those ones were toxic. No, no, like those were, like, those are markers like for kids, not like the the sharpies and stuff. But they were still like encouraging kids to smell markers. You know? They smelled really good. They did. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Killing bitches? Probably. That sounds. That sounds likely. We did kill the. We killed the. The surgeon dude. Yeah. The butcher doctor guy. Yeah, he died. Um. And then we found. We found the next area. But I don't think we had the spell we needed. We need like a different spell. So I think we have to we have to harvest some body parts. I think that's what we're doing. Got to ha harvest some body parts. Hi browser. Hi Dave. What is what is Tipex? What is that? I don't know what that is. Should we see what we're doing? We stalled for 50 minutes? How the fuck has it been 50 minutes? It was like five. I'm not in the game. Oh, whiteout. Do people still, do people still use that? Did you guys ever paint your nails with whiteout? Or know people that did when you were bored in class. Not like the there, because there was when whiteout, like when we, when we used it in school, we didn't have like the fancy, the fancy, um, you know, like the strips that they got eventually. It was the like the, the stuff you dipped, and it, it looked it had like the same brush as like nail polish. All the important questions today, yes. Did you paint your nails with white out? Have you ever lost contact behind your eye? <laughs> Did, you... <laughs> Did you smell markers? <laughs> I do, fish. How are you? How's it going? Do you press the side of your nose? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh, they're one of the one of the monkeys, really? Oh my god! Oh, I remember 
else I was gonna ask you guys. Did you guys watch um, Hot Ones with Conan? Very, very random. Very random, I know, and it feels like it came from nowhere. But, yes, it was amazing. It was so funny. <laughs> I fucking love Conan. Oh my god, you heard about it, Waffle? It's like a slow descent into madness, and it's amazing. Um, it was, really, it was so good. It was so good. He's comedy gold every time. He's so fucking funny. Like, holy shit, he's funny. You heard it was spicy, Dragoonius? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was great. You saw it posted somewhere? You haven't, you haven't watched it yet? Um, you should watch it. It's good. You know, he's comedy gold he wrote The Simpsons mod. Apparently, TP, he got the inspiration for, the, for that because he was driving somewhere in, like, the rural United States and he just saw a billboard that literally just said monorail and nothing else. <laughs> and now... <laughs> like, how did he come up with that? Hi, Austin. Do you guys remember how to play? Okay, okay, so we run. This. Attack. Heavy attack. What does Y do? Nothing. B is, B is dodge. Let's see. Conan was just on Fallon, too. Yeah. Yeah, I saw that. Nobody of nowhere wants to buy a photograph of a spirit. Felix wants the rusty cage key. It's somewhere disgusting. Emma wants a green enchant scroll. So we need, um... Okay. I think if we get to, I think if we get to level five. So we need a heart heart and a finger and a human finger and the heart is from the big guy Ew, he sounded really squishy. Did you guys hear that? He gave us a finger though. We still need we still need a heart. We still need a heart. Hi Jacket. Lucy, welcome it. Food? Food. The finger? Should we eat the finger? I need two hearts. I think so, but I think Oh my god. I think if we, um...
Excuse me! I think, uh, what was I saying? Ooh, for sake kit. Where'd they go? Where'd they go? Where'd they go? <laughs> like, literally. <laughs> there, there's nothing I can do. There's nothing I can do. can go to where's the first switch this one hello i would like to offer you this oh what do we want guys health curse tolerance immunity let's get more health we're level three hi Lazel. We need another heart. Bitch. Okay, we need we need another heart. We need another heart. We need another heart. Oh, and she uncursed me. That's fucking rude. Hi, Trendy. We should We should be safe in the hallway here. This is the library. Hello? Who was laughing? Who the fuck was laughing? Is that the curse, maybe? I don't 
don't know why there's a chair. There's a chair and you can sit in it and be really dramatic. The random giggling, yeah, who the fuck is laughing at me? Nothing's funny. This is a serious game for serious people. Is there... <laughs> These are sweaty try-hard hours. Sitting in a chair already? Am I? How did I like miss half of those? I like the squishy sounds they make when their corpse falls to the floor. scare me? I'm never scared. How dare you? Oh my god! <laughs> Fine. Oh, we're poisoned. Antidote, do I? Oh, I do. Look at that. Oh, good thing I used it. <laughs> weapons yet. We found a we found a knife. But it wasn't great. Here you go. I don't know I don't know how to I don't know how to do this. Let's get some immunity maybe. Level four. Oh we need a human finger. Anybody, um, anybody, uh, got a spare finger? I think. Can I have yours, Wendy? That's very kind. Where'd she 
Oh my god. her to just have her finger um she would have let me <laughs> like we didn't we didn't need anything else you know we just wanted a finger well done thank you You've proven yourself worthy of possessing an advanced grimoire. Use an occult wax table to mix your wax together through colors and spells. Okay, 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 okay. <gasps> we get an outfit at level 10. Two human fingers. I I don't have I don't have those. I don't have those. So now, balls. If we balls. If we go. Where's the wax table? Inventory workbench. Here. We gotta go. We gotta go here. We gotta go here. Yeah. Does this work? Oh. Bookshelf passage. Remembrance shrine. Okay, 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 let's go. Uh, gotta make the thing that we need to go into the place. You guys with me? So, we need this. We need that. And now, we need to be cursed to go to the mausoleum? <laughs> Question mark? I think so. I think that'll work. All right, so let's um, put this back on. bed for some reason. That doesn't seem safe. Do the bodies ever disappear? Um, probably not until you die. Yeah, probably not until you die. Alright, so we're gonna go remains. Oh, we haven't killed any of those. What are you? I brought a thing for you. Our search can teach you how to make your own enchant spell. Yeah, yeah. If you scroll statue on the head, made... no, I got it for you. Here you go. Oh no, I fucked up. Guys, I didn't hit the candle. Um. <laughs> yeah. Um. What's in there is pretty valuable. I think I'll keep it for myself. No hard feelings. What is happening right now? Oh, there we go. What the? What the? What the? What? 
Where did, how did I, where did I, hello? <laughs> how did I get in here? Oh, cool music though. I feel like that just glitched. I, was I, I feel like I was supposed to kill that thing. Speedrun strats, yeah. Definitely a bug or a strategy. I like to think it was a strategy. <laughs> it seemed like a boss. <laughs> it did seem like a boss. Oh. Um, but they kicked me inside, so. There's that. Father, sister, mother. Maybe should read more carefully. And Sunsetate every letter of his family's Latin inscriptions. Father, two precious children in his heart. Sister, four corners of the world to explore with her family. Mother, six days a week caring for the rest and one day to honor God. What? Truly the family is divine. Father, two precious children in his heart. Alphabet? No. There's only, there's a there's a couple there's a couple missing. It's mostly the entire alphabet. It looks like there were three like three missing. <laughs> you think it's A B C? wondering So okay, Anne was born in 18 1825, 1825 1846 1813 1846. Okay, so Priscilla Priscilla Dad. 
Okay. So I think... I can't believe it, you've gotten the eye back. I apologize for the exception of this mask. Allow me to properly introduce myself. I am Peter. The, yeah, I was like, are you? Oh, he's dead in the real world? He's a ghost. Allow me to explain, you're a ghost. My twin sister Priscilla and I have been interested in magic since we were children. We always hoped to find a way to contact our dear deceased mother, but nothing worked. It wasn't until 1874 that we finally found real magic. We were invited on a diplomatic trip, okay, Constantinople. Why though? When my father worked to um, ingratiate himself with the politicians we had traveled with, Priscilla and I searched for artifacts to purchase. After many encounters with shady merchants and frauds, we were finally shown this idol with ruby eyes. The price was high, but we were promised miraculous effects that the idol was purchased. That night, Priscilla and I awoke in the dream for the first time. You see, this idol is the source of the dream, and it recreates anything its ruby eyes see. Idol is the painter of is a painter of sorts. It tries to portray its subjects accurately, but is prone to extrapolation and flights of fancy. Hi, Costanza. How's the day going? Once its ruby gaze has fallen upon someone, it will incorporate them into the dream. Father caught a fever. Only a few days after purchasing the idol, Priscilla showed symptoms of the fever as well. Then a fortnight, they were both dead. Fortnight. What's fortnight, guys? My grief, as you can imagine, was boundless. But to my utter astonishment, Priscilla was still alive in the dream. The idol did not know of her death. I returned home with the bodies and the idol. As I showed the more of the house and of life, the dream grew grander. I was able to convince the idol that magic exists with some simple parlor tricks and pyrotechnics! That sounds fun. In the dream, my sister and I slowly created a paradise. Of course, even with magic in the dream, we were never able to meet Mother. The idol had never seen her. As you have seen, Dr. Blackett and his henchmen have turned the dream into a nightmare. It is time to end the dream by destroying the idol's representation of itself in the dream. Thank you for returning the eye to which I've done it myself. Oh, oh, he's gonna do it. Okay, go ahead. <gasps> I don't... I don't think he did it. Um... <laughs> he, uh... He's dead, yeah! <laughs> You've been quite a naughty boy, haven't you? 
Excellent work, Mr. Wretch. Peter, my old friend, how far you have fallen. I tried to help you. Why did you try to destroy the dream? Collect the ashes. Peter shall cause us no more trouble. Take the girl! No! Oh, I don't... I don't get a choice. <laughs> hey, chat! Um... Did I skip a boss fight there? We're taken to the observatory in the attic. Eventually, the wretch's sleep spell begins to wane. She wakens to find a letter at the foot of her bed. Feel like I did? Yes? I'm a genius. <laughs> so smart! New quest. I'm terribly sorry for the frightful events you bore witness to. Peter was a sick man, determined to destroy the dream, even if it meant forever snuffing out its inhabitants. I understand you must be alarmed and confused. It would not surprise me if you think me a monster. I must assure you that these are slanderous falsehoods and that no harm shall come to you in the dream. I'm afraid I have pressing business to attend to. Please remain safe in the observatory until I return and I will explain everything. Your friend. He's not a friend. He's not a friend. Yeah, I'm a speedrunner. Yeah. Seven, seven, nine, seven, nine. No, it's probably, wait, hold on, look at that again. I think I did that backwards. But no, but it started, no, it started at the bottom. That's probably right. Seven, nine. Seven, seven, nine, seven, nine. Seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six. No, I'm doing this backwards. This is this way. Three, 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 nine, six. Three nine six. So smart. Permanent artifact. Cursed stuff box. You want a better telescope? Yeah. Yeah, me too. <laughs> What's kind of shitty? <laughs> um. Oh, this is like a uh, three damage, three curse damage per second. Mirror shield. Block all incoming curse damage. It will eventually break. Oh my god. What the fuck is this? A map. Where am I? I'm there. Attic A. Storage hall. Attic B. New quest. Blocked. Dark Souls. Organ grease! That sounds creepy. I don't know. I don't know that I. I don't know that I want that. It's locked. How the fuck do I get out of here? Bum, 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 bum,
awkward. Not really. We didn't actually fight. Not too pleased to see me? No, I am. Thank you for kicking me into the mausoleum. We're all on the same side. Me and the butcher surgeon had an uneasy alliance. I killed him. He would guard the eye and I would guard the idol. Peter wanted to destroy the dream. Robert Blackett wanted to turn the dream into his plaything. Not a fan of either outcome, so I worked with the butcher to keep the idol out of their hands. I was convinced you were one of Robert's lackeys. Can you blame me? You did everything they asked, whether you knew it or not. And I've been locked up in the observatory, so you're not aligned with them, at least not yet. Oh, <gasps> we got a key! Thank you! Now that Robert has full control of the idol again, we're in tremendous danger. We need to find out what he's planning. Two places that might have the answer. Robert's room and the entrance hall. Okay. Have we been to the wrong room? You just open it, open and close the door three times and then go in. It's a spell my friend Millie came up with. Creates a false version of a room in the mansion. Okay. Okay. Just to pull great pranks and the other initiatives by luring them into it. The last prank we pulled was pointing the wrong room at the entrance hall. Not long after, I saw Millie in the hallway, but she was a ghost. But the wrong room, as you can see for yourself, has become a cursed place. Because the entrance hall must be a cursed place too. Millie and 12 other people are now ghosts? That's a lot of ghosts. The first witch has something to do with it as well. I ever heard her talking about creating a binding spell for something. Wait, 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 wait. He says if I want a person, you have to defeat her to get your hand. The first witch? Is it. We have to. Kill her? Robert's room is along the upper hallway. You should search his room thoroughly. I know he's hiding something. Be careful, though. Okay. They, like the first witch, have hardened their bodies against the effects of being cursed. Keep your eyes out for initiates, Grimoire. Do we have that? Which one did we get? There's loads of spells in there that do direct physical damage instead of curse damage. But the first witch has one hidden in her bedroom. Okay. 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 I don't want to kill her though. If I. If I. Oh my god. If I kill her, how am I gonna level up? Fuck you. Fuck you. 
Yeah, we're probably dead. I kind of panicked when I saw the face. And then there was, um, there was also, um, the fucking... There was, uh, the ba 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 you know? Oh, this guy's just, like, fucking punching me. go back out there because there's a giant face there's also a bear trap <laughs> there's al there's also um I don't know what to do with the bear trap think I could roll through it? <laughs> we need a bear. The cage guy walked right over it. Yeah. Do you think I can do that? I don't like the face. Huh. <laughs> Why is he so creepy?
Just looking for babies. Peekaboo. Yeah, that is that is true. <clears throat> Go away. Go away. Fuck off. Don't look at me. <laughs> Don't know what my plan is here. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Fuck. I don't know what my plan is here. It was your birthday, Chris? Happy birthday. Attic room A. Forever. <laughs> no, I don't like it in here either! <laughs> it sucks in here too! Okay. Yeah, we're gonna die. Oh my god. scary again. I'm not scared. Do I look scared? Because I'm not. Oh, I can go this way? Look at this. Guys. We found a scone. Who the fuck are you? Are you alive? Permanent key. Removes the wooden planks blocking access between the upper floor and the ground floor. Okay. <gasps> we got an axe! Um, um, oh! You aren't scared. Son well, of a bitch! That's good to know. Stop hitting random non hostile people you run into. To be fair, he is not a person. He is a corpse. Um, <laughs> John, thank you for the bits. <laughs> I appreciate it. Thank you. We got a tool. Candlestick. Fire damage. Dude, balls. Son of a bitch. Where does this go? Oh my god, no, thank you. No, I'm good. Sorry. I didn't. Oh my god. Where'd you go? to disturb you. I just thought maybe, um, oh my god, too scary. Okay. Everything is too scary. <gasps> A 
I need another finger. Chat? Who's got a spare finger? It's locked. Where the fuck am I? Is this? the one who cleared the surgeon out here. I am. That was me. Yeah, I murdered him. My sincere thanks. I arrived on the train just a few nights ago, only to find my usual haunt occupied by that brute. The name is Tomos. Just a humble merchant trying to make my way through the dream. As a thank you, I'll show you some items you won't find anywhere else. He's got permanent items. Fashion record. What is it? I want a new outfit. Give me your shit, dude! He won't give it to me. He won't give me this stuff. Okay, 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 okay. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. What are we gonna do? 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 We are going to curse. We're going to curse. We're going to go in the mirror. We're going to profit somehow. <laughs> that's, that's as far as I got. Um, and a portal. Go in here. Hi, Ollie Cat. How's your, uh, how's your night going? I need a thing that has a, whatchamacallit, Right. Here we go. This is what I want. This is what I was trying to get to. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Thanks, liar. How's your night going? Cause I want. Um. I want to. Bum, 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 bum. We don't need. Okay. We don't need this anymore, right? We don't need this because we have the big one now. So I want to remember the axe. Because I think the axe... The axe is better than the cleaver. I made a song, did I? Fuck yeah, I did. <laughs> did I make that song? Okay, that's what we're gonna do. Okay. So false, fuck, shit, false, 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 false. What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? I am very musical, yeah. The album is coming soon. Why did I need fingers? <laughs> Remember, I was like, guys, I need two fingers. Why did I need two fingers? We gotta kill some witches. All right, let's go. Let's go kill some witches. Also known as bitches. Wait, was I just in the wine cellar? I could have stayed there. I think. I think the witches are downstairs, right? I feel like they're downstairs. That's cool. This game's so cool, guys. I really like it. It's fucking scary though. Holy shit. It's way scary that like the observatory area was way scarier than it needed to be. <laughs> it was so fucking scary. Chopping players and little bit of pieces in PvP. Nice. 
fuck him up. Go away. Thank you. Worm dude! Where's Leo? Leo, that's a worm. And you know it. <laughs> Definitely not a dude in a blanket. That is a worm. One or two fingers for some shrine. Was it for a shrine? Might have been a shrine. I just remember getting really excited that I needed... Yes, remember it's shrine. Yeah, 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 I think you're right. I also need two human fingers to level up, though. I feel like we should do this. I feel like we should get to level 10. Um, because eventually it seems like we're going to kill the witch. So I want to make sure that we level. I got bored. have a scone that you can eat. Yum. So, we have two human fingers. We have two human fingers. Let's There's no mirror there. Why is there no mirror there anymore? Excuse me! Hello! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Where the fuck am I? Delicious. Blank initiate initiate book. Oh, that's what the that's what she wanted. Wait, 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 balls, 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 balls. Hold on. She might she might attack me. She might attack me. I just wanted to level. She might try to kill me. Whatever are you doing at the observatory, I came to see you. I know it must be boring. I promise as soon as Dr. Blackett completes his business, he will explain everything. You've done phenomenally well here in the dream. Thank you. It would be a shame for things to start going poorly now, wouldn't it? So please turn around and head back up to the observatory like a good girl. Can I... Can I, can I level? <laughs> Since you seem unable to follow such a simple command, I will have to return you to the observatory myself. Oh, boss. Oh! Son of a bitch! That fucking- 
fucking hurt. Not so far. Yeah. Ew, what is that? Um, okay, yeah, she, okay, balls. She's balls. She's balls. Strong. <laughs> she's very, she's very strong. Uh. Maybe we can just sneak in and steal that thing, though. How's this game? It's really cool. It's really, really cool. I'm liking it a lot. It's quite scary, though, at times. It's quite scary. Oh, wait, did I, did I get it already? Oh, I do have it. Okay. I'm going to ignore her. I brought it. Boss fight. But, like, not actually. What else can we do? Or Robert Blackett's room to find a key. Where the fuck is that? Where the fuck is that? Where is that guy? Do we go back in the scary? The scary hallway? I don't... I don't... I don't like it. I don't like it out here. Wait. If we're not gonna- if we're not gonna level, we should do this. Oh wait, not this one. Where was the one? Where was the one, uh, west stairwell? This one. So we get to, we get to remember one more thing. Should we remember the chocolate cake? Chocolate cake seems good. We're gonna remember this for now because I feel like that's related to a quest. IRL, yes. Oh my god. See you! So good to see you! Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's a really good time! Sunday, hope you're doing well. Don't look at the windows. Let's just eat a scone. Okay. Pretend that um you're not looking out there. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Actually, I kinda wanna go in here.
This guy. Corpse party. We got we got him, but <laughs> we got him, but we also died. Bogus. I got a little bit greedy. They stay dead. The responding me. They stay dead as long as you don't die. And then everything, like it's, it's kind of like a roguelike a little bit. So it's like when you die, a lot of, a lot of stuff changes. You can also, yeah, you can restart a new night if you want to. this one go? Where the fuck am I? <laughs> Upper parlor. Okay. Who are you? What is going on? Why are there children here? I stole their cake. That's my cake now. Who are you? You remind me of my daughter. I'm Jeremiah. Okay. I do maintenance for the asylum, so I know these grounds better than anybody. I live in one of the cottages in the valley, but the dream takes me back here each night. What a funny little slice of hell we found ourselves in. You guys want cake too? Say, I'm sure you could use a few things I found. An old mansion like this is just riddled with discarded valuables. If you can spare a few coins, I can spare some of these treasures. What you got? Oh, he's got like the basics. A cup of tea. He's got some uh, first aid kits. Permanent treasure. When faced with a difficult puzzle, one can choose to instantly solve it. No, fuck that. <gasps> Grandmother clock key, I want this though. Maintenance key that unlocks any grandfather clock in the mansion, allowing for the time to be set. What do, what does that have to do with anything? Why would we? Why would? Why would we? What? But why? Who are you? Becca, you seem familiar. Things have been a bit hazy. I'm Becca. Nice to meet you. Or re-meet you. Have you seen this dollhouse? Is she... Is she the one... Is that her face? If you look closely enough, you can see little creatures moving about inside. Can we kill her so she stops looking at us? Isn't the dream just grand? You can do anything here. You look like you could use some training. I'm the very first person besides- Oh! Oh! Balls. We 
gave away our fingers. <laughs> but she's the new witch. She's the new one. That's why we get to kill the other one. Guys. So no worries. That looks... That looks fucking scary. Did you guys see that dude with the giant axe? Let's go back up to the attic. Not <laughs> a sentence you hear every day. That's like... That's like most of my stream, yeah. She wants me to kill the first one and this one? Does she? Spoilers. Spoilers. You have so many questions. Oh, you meant me? You think I want to kill Becca? I mean, if she doesn't stop fucking looking at me through the window, yeah, I do want to kill her. We're not bleeding, we're still poisoned though. Skull ring. Still poisoned. I do need I need to eat some some uh, human fingers, yes. An amulet? Why the fuck did I get this? from See all those dudes? <laughs> so many dudes. What the fuck? It's a lot of dudes. Dudes for days. <laughs> dudes for days. Um Remember the hallway? Samantha, I 
probably had to call assistance in my room for nearly a full hour tonight. If you don't show up tomorrow, I'll simply enchant the bell to assist me and you'll be dismissed from your duties. Don't disappoint me again. Robert. Upper initiate. Why don't people wear witch hats anymore? Um, they don't want to be burned at this stake. That'd be my guess. <laughs> that right now because we got fucked up okay so there's a there's a bed here and there's a closet there's weird little like turny things on the wall Painted on it. Fifty percent more spell toll. Thirty percent spell damage. Okay. Nope. Too strong. <laughs> nope. does something. I 
don't have a skeleton elevator in my house? I don't, no. Should I get one? There was something I was gonna do. What was I gonna do? Do I have two fingers? I have four fingers. We can get back to the parlor. We gotta get we gotta get to the parlor. We gotta get to the end of this hallway. We gotta get to the end of this hallway. on fire. What the fuck? That's so fucked up. Level, please. Level six. Two corrupted hearts. I don't. I don't have that. I don't have that. Where do we think the rusty cage key is? Somewhere disgusting. Mostly bad. So I have, I never, uh, I never played it. Would I like a hint? It's not great. Yeah. Um. Okay, I'll ask you, I'll ask you a yes or no question. I'm assuming I know the answer. I'm assuming I know the answer. But is it somewhere I've been? Already? Mostly bad. That's awesome you had fun with it. No, 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 I'm not, like, I haven't played it, so I don't know. Um, but no, if you're having fun with it, like, that's fantastic. That's, that's the dream, right? I just, uh, I heard, I heard mixed things about it. And I never, like, I never had the time to, to play it. I think I was, people were playing it when I was playing Liza P, which I was really liking. So curious as to what the negative aspects are. It's hard. It's hard to say because, like, I didn't. Again, I didn't play it. I know. I know Squilla didn't like it. Um, and I don't think KW did either. Who are really the only people I know that didn't really like it. Um, I. I think. I think there were just too many like gang squads. Too many trash mobs. Yeah. Yeah, kind of like the same issue people have with like Dark Souls 2 sometimes. You know? It is somewhere I've been before. Okay. That's good to know. Alright. Gang Squad, as you can see, yeah. Which is kind of why I avoided it. Because I feel like that type of difficulty I don't really like. Like I'd probably get annoyed with it. But I never actually, uh... I've never actually played it. Two corrupted hearts. 
hearts. Where looks was the rusty cage key? Somewhere disgusting. All right, let's let's look around. Let's look around. I think I want to go back to the observatory and then go down down the stairs. Were the try at least? Patches have definitely helped filter out the more head scratch levels of mine. <laughs> yeah, I I heard that they uh, they fixed it a little bit after people complained, which kind of sucks because that's clearly not the way they designed their game. What am I doing? What am I doing? Let's go. Uh, I'm just gonna like unlock a little bit of the map right now. Maybe search for some stuff. Look up scone. A new friend. Hello, friend. We fucked her up. Well, the game had potential wasn't for you. I think it's what I expected. It just felt off, really hard to explain. It was, um, it was a game that when people were telling me about it, I was like, personally, like, I don't, the, the complaints were things that would probably annoy me because I'd probably be really bad at it. <laughs> I'd just be dying repeatedly, you know? What am I doing? What am I doing? Guys, what am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, we could take a picture. We could take a picture for Lord Nobody of Nowhere. Yeah. That seems like a good idea. Do you have an outfit you like to strengthen the services free of charge? Whoa, 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 whoa. Free of charge? What the fuck? He'll just, he'll just do this? The voice acting is great thus far. Oh, that's cool. I, I love, like, I love solid voice acting. It adds so much to a game. Okay. Oh. Oh, I probably shouldn't have done that. That was like, uh, hey, you get one of these. Do you want to use it on anything? And I was like, three? Can I do them all? No, of course you can't. <laughs> of course you can't. That would be stupid. Uh, hello? I kind of want the blonde hair. Final Fantasy VII Rebirth voice acting is your favorite. Baldur's Gate 3 is so good for the voice acting. Like, so, so good. Huh? one of these worm dudes yet. Until now. Corrupted meat. Healing item. Plus 75 health, but you become poisoned? That's kind of fucked up. One heart, we need another, we need another heart. Everybody. A new 
A night. They're not dead, they're just resting. Oh, I just wanna can I loot the corpse? There we go. <laughs> I just wanted to loot the corpse. Where's that bitch going? I'm gonna learn how to walk like that. That's gonna be my new walk. Okay. I'm gonna walk like that everywhere. Posture, yeah. like exactly where the camera is. See her scratching up the carpet? Come right here. Come here. Come here. Come say hi. Oh, she's stretching. I love her so much. Okay, she's done. carpet a bit you know rub on the box she's like hey good to see you just making sure everything's okay down here all right we got we got some stuff guys we got some stuff do we have two do we have two hearts we have two hearts so we should go, we should go level. We should go level. Is there a mirror in here? One, one over, one over. Where's the, where's the, um, parlor? Parlor has no parlor, doesn't have a mirror. Food, yes, my food store is still alive. Pretty much. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. I don't want to die. Guys, whenever I have, like, a good night going, and I'm making progress. I really don't want to die. Seven. Where do we get the corrupted liver from? Do we know? Bonnie bag. We haven't found a liver yet. body bag it's not a worm it's a worm oh it's a worm yeah, yeah yeah what do you mean worm 
Sure. What? <laughs> what, do you see something different? That says worm. Is a surgeon the taste of livers the people I deliver? Yes. They spell worm funny. They do. They do, yeah. It's a different spelling. <laughs> it's a bit odd that they spell it that way. Where the fuck are we going, guys? We need to, um... We need to find a liver. Who the fuck has a liver? Probably one of the things on the top floor, because they're fucking scary. Oh, let, should we go in the wrong room? Let's find it. Let's find a wrong room. How do I? How do I do this? Here we go. One. is this? Oh, don't touch that. Oh my god, it curses you. Oh, it curses you. go under there we could take a picture if we go to the um That's me. Stealthy. <laughs> Super stealth. Very stealthy, guys. Okay, we're gonna go to the... remember how <laughs> they uh they taught me 
Got film loaded? How do I do that? I have film. Two. But it says zero of two. Is it loaded? It's loaded. <laughs> I need to reload. Hold R1, press circle. I'm using an Xbox controller. Do you know what the... Press the shoot without aiming. Thank you. going somewhere else. Maybe there's somebody in here. What the fuck are you? Did you guys see that bitch? How big he was? He's probably friendly. Starting room. Guest, bed guest bedroom. Stole is gone. Mine's gone now. I remember seeing a um oops. I remember seeing uh uh ba -ba -ba -da -ba, you know here once Thank you. Who is this now? The noise the noises are great, yeah. means we're gonna die shortly. <laughs> Nothing can stop me! <laughs> yeah, we're so dead. I wish you could 
could just use the things in the thing without having to go to the whatchamacallit. Chat, where's the disgusting place? I'm ready for him. For that. <gasps> Around the same areas as Felix and his cage. Okay. I'm scared of the this. <laughs> Makes me slightly cursed. cards to come visit me. Oh, cool. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. That's pretty cool. Oh, I like that. All right, balls. Let's go find Felix. Where the fuck is Felix? <laughs> Felix. Felix. Felix is 
here. Okay. So in the basement somewhere, probably. Okay, this has been a good night. This has been a very good night. I want to let his puppers out. Coins do. Did it? What? Did she do? Did she? Is she just fucking with me? Must be careful with fire. She's fucking with me. Some severed head. The top of the skull has been sawed open. Produces a poisonous gas cloud. That sounds fun. Doesn't that sound fun, guys? Why am I using a fucking twig? <laughs> I feel like it's in this toilet. Reach into the toilet. You will not regret this. Not one bit. I have regrets. <laughs> let's, let's dust ourselves off. I feel like we already do. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whenever somebody says that, I mean, I got regrets. Okay, so he's gonna, he's gonna meet me in the parlor. Hi, Rizu. Good to see you. For your special service. As I understand, you witches always need a body parts, fingers, hearts, that sort of thing. I don't know much about witchcraft myself, but I do know how to procure these offerings. They're skilled hunters! You just let me know if you'd like us to go hunting, we can make a deal. I want a liver, please. That 
that's pretty cool. Oh, that's super helpful. Like a serial killer, yeah. Like my own little personal serial killer with this dog. sitting in the parlor. We did that before and nothing happened. Oh, I need another liver! Balls! Felix! So left 76 coins. Okay. Give me one of these. Be right back. BRB chat. Not me. Felix. And his pooch. The dog on drugs already? Maybe. Possibly. Thank you! Health, please. Level 9. Curse Sentinel Candle. Where the fuck do I get that? He can hunt that stuff, can he? No, he only gives me body parts. Okay, so now we need a we need a candle somewhere. Probably have to kill like a in the hedge maze wants a green enchant scroll. Didn't we do that? Is that because it bugged? Where is Emma? Emma is in the place. Probably bugged. That fucking sucks. the thing that she wanted. So we can give that to her. It's not. That's not what I have. Damn. You're all packed and ready. What time? Uh, what time do you leave? She's on, um, 
She's on this floor though, right? Oh, I think I know where she is, hold on. I think I know where she is. her health, but she's at like a quarter. record an Oregon grease what did I want this for <laughs> what did I want this for I remember oh we're poisoned or also cursed I'm probably gonna die Did she escape? No, we murdered her. We killed her. She's dead. She's dead, guys. Did we get the thing that we needed, though? Room. Did we need to kill her? <laughs> maybe, <laughs> maybe we didn't need to kill her. I mean, she's dead now. 
Um, so there's that. But it's possible we didn't need to kill her. Got another remembrance slot though. And remembrance tier. We can remember two more things! What are we remembering? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Balls, 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 balls. Um. Let's take a look at our equipment. We got, we got some fashion records, we got that. Okay, we got two amulets. Poison resistance and speed, so we're using that one. Having damage received. going to remember I think it's possible me though to not kill though no no we're gonna murder everybody <laughs> yeah 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 we're gonna murder everybody get fucked zombies um <laughs> A, it is a cool game, yeah! Yeah, I'm really liking it. I have no idea how far I am. Um, let's go to the entrance hall. I don't know where that is, though. Where's the entrance hall? Basement hallway. The stairwell. Maybe that's this place? It's not short. It doesn't seem short. And it also seems like you can replay it a lot. You know? What's that noise? Hey, Robbie. It did, didn't it? Kind of fucked up. No more music. We st we stole his soul. Um. I don't even know if this is the place where I'm supposed to go. Banquet hall. There's a stairwell. Guys, where the fuck is the entrance hall? Banquet hall. Upper banquet hall. Observatory. Stairwell. Stairwell. Attic. Hallway. Attic. Ground floor. Basement. You can see it on the paper map. Thank you. I forgot I had that. Banquet hall. So it is... It's like here somewhere. Was this here before? It's locked. It's locked. It's locked, it's locked, it's locked. But I have, um... I have... This.
do you draw this though? In the around the fireplace. Around the fireplace. Where's the fucking fireplace? This one's getting tall. Trendy, thanks for hanging out. I really appreciate it. Hi, Raptor. Oh my god, don't touch that. How the fuck? What am I missing, guys? Entrance hall. Entrance hall is here, so I just I don't have the key, right? I have to find the key. I have to find the key. Which I don't have yet. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's find. Let's find the key. Um. Oh, explore Robert Blackett's room to find a key. <laughs> to the entrance hall. <laughs> it's one of my quests. I see. Uh huh. Um. I knew that. It's over here. <laughs> okay. How are we gonna get there? What's the easiest way to get there? Uh, if we go up and then over. <laughs> Get out of my head, game! They're like, Lily, we literally cannot make this any simpler for you. We wrote it down. It's like one of three things we wrote down for you. <laughs> Why are you struggling with this so much? Read the fucking quest. Big wretch. Corrupted heart, corrupted finger, too. Oh, he gave me a lot. Actually. He gave me a lot. Where are we going? Oh, to get a key. I remember. It only happened a couple minutes ago. I got a little distracted, though. Hold on. Where am I? I would like to maybe craft some stuff. Because, um, I used up all my supplies. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> no, thank you. There, now we have, now we have some healing. All right. Okay. Wait. Oh, that's the... in here because there was a crafting table and then left. Um, 
All right, so. There's a key somewhere in here. a key to the entrance hall. So that's where we are. We're here. And there's this weird skeleton thing. And a bear. <laughs> there's, a, there's a bear. A picture of a lady. We can chomp at that. There's gotta be, there's gotta be a key somewhere in this room. The question is, how do we fucking find it? Do we have any items? You're so close to a million channel points! What do you want for your million points? want to waste them. Um, Tanzi, are you going to watch the Fallout episodes? You saw um, all of Wheel of Time instead? You like second scene ending, but um, that all things went down the book? No! No! I. What happens in the in the second season, Tanzi? No, I'm reading, I'm reading the books. Um, like rereading them. I'm on the second right now. And the books are very different. You have 1.5 mil. What do? Celebrate. <laughs> Do a little dance. Like, look at me. I'm rich in a made up currency. Because <laughs> what am I missing in here? So we can. We can turn them. Trying to push two mil? Oh my god. We can do this. But we don't know why. See if we can find the book. This is where the book is supposed to be too. And it's got one of these weird things too. What if we're... What if we're cursed? What if we're cursed a little bit? Let's try that. Hi Wiggle! somewhere. Thank you. 
You switch over to collect channel points? Smart. Smart, you got it. Oh, what the fuck was that? You gotta get those points. They're very useful. Organ processing. Hello? Mechanical genius at the combination of the organ storage state, the last three digits of the birth year. Priscilla. 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 846. Lab manual. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Permanently erase and troublesome foe from the dream. What? For a brief enemies, two miles of work increase one more you killed. What? What is this? Ancient blood, permanent offering times three. Some relief. The ship's gone for ages. Yeah. I know the first witch is busy, but this is ridiculous. I've been here three nights. Let me give you some tips. Okay. When someone brings in some organs, help them use the furnace to create organ grease. Have them step into the chamber. You need to pour the proper amount of organ grease in and deposit some coins. Chamber is mechanical wonder. Once they've shaken the bottom of the chamber, ask them to go collect more organs. This offering less chamber if they need any help. Thank you. Don't leave, or the first witch will be very cross. She's dead. She's she, she can't be cross. She's dead. dead. Um... What is it? What is this? What is this? What is... What the fuck is this? What is this? I wasn't listening. Six organ grease? Six? Oh. I mean, I have 12 fingers. We can, we can do it. I think it only wanted one though. Didn't that just say one? I can't fucking find it. Am I 
Am I missing something obvious? Chat, what do you guys think? This is Margaret's room. Upper bathroom. Okay, so the quest says Explore his room to find the key to the entrance hall. Robert Blackett's room. Robert Blackett's room. Would I like a hint? Yes, please. Does it have to do with the skeleton thing? It's the only thing in here that fucking moves. You need some help to operate the cranks. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Maybe I forgot I killed that guy. Okay, we've been alive for a long time. Will the kids help me? Children. Will you help me? No, you'll you'll just sell me stuff. My buttons. What a fucking cheater. Did you report him to Blizzard? Be like, hey, this guy's cheating. He's got extra fingers. <laughs> Where the fuck am I going? Um. <laughs> Eric, how's it going? <laughs> Lone girl with an axe. Yeah. Maybe, um. safe in here? Oh no, safe. As in, you won't die. end of the hot this one. This one, this one. Places a hex on a door. That's armor. This creates a dummy. This! Maybe. this? Is this it? Three seasons of armors of dolls can be enchanted to do battle for the caster. Fire. Energy. Do I have enough for this? Let's take one of those. Should you answer that? Yes or no? Just say yes or no. Thanks for asking. That's very nice. Yes. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, let's try that. Okay, let's, let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. Um, I always forget how to use the fucking spells. 
Must be near a suit of armor or a doll. room has a doll. Can I get the bear? I want the bear. This guy. Help me! Ready, buddy? We're gonna be best friends, okay? Yes, that would be really cool. Hey, turn this. <laughs> Maybe it's something with hands free? He's got one free hand. What does he need two hands for? He's lazy. Lazy little bitch. We'll find somebody, we'll find somebody. I need a doll. He's got his hands full. room. Probably have to, probably have to get this. But that's so scary. Because, because um, well, you guys know we're probably gonna die. What about this guy? He gave me money. That's a corpse. All right. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna get the doll. We're gonna get the doll. Try something. I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna see if this works. We might lose this guy. <gasps> we don't lose this guy! Fuck yeah! Okay, let's go. to work. You turn that 
for me? Thank you. But where did it? I forgot that. That's so music. I forgot that we could die. Star is a single note. Oh, maybe we have to look at the. We have to look at the stars. Where the fuck am I? Secret attic room. Going one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, 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 eight, six, eight, no, eight, six. Is that a G? Oh, this means nothing. What the fuck does this mean? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Each cluster of stars a single note. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Eight and six. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Eight and six. Eight. Six. What the fuck? What is this? Maybe you just count them? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is that eight? Eight. 
814. Let's just do 814. Maybe I'm making it more complicated. So now we gotta get back to here. Okay. 814. 
Oh, we actually got it at, like, less than half. Well, the doll's back. <laughs> the doll's back, guys. brought a doll to a fight with a demon. candle offering. Crystal again. Millie! The Goddard. Easy. Easy game for babies. Explore beneath the fireplace. How the fuck are we still alive? Guys. Don't get cursed. 
we're a little we're a little bit cursed. We're a little bit cursed. I can't open this, can I? Goddamn pro, yeah. Yeah, yeah. This game is so pretty. It this game is really fucking cool. There's a ladder. Why are we in a tunnel? This, this seems like a bad idea. There's corpses down here. Hello? What? Why is it? Where are we going? Oh, Margaret, sorry to sneak up on you again. I followed you down the fireplace. You've stumbled upon something that even I don't have an answer for. Where does this cable car lead? Who built it? I think my father was down here earlier. He must know. I'm sure you think he's an evil man. I must admit, I didn't think he was capable of just erasing Peter. What? But you have to understand his intentions are- Oh, the dude who he set on fire! Okay, I'm certain there's a good reason for all of this. When we get to the side, please do not interfere. Let me talk some sense into him. Um... Yeah, she's in denial. She's in denial that her father is a bad man. That would actually be a very hard thing to deal with. Can I search this body? Happy New Year! Oh! <gasps> Happy New Year! <laughs> Nightingale awakens in the strange infirmary. Appears to be 24 years in the future. Sound of a distant bell wakes her. We got, we got some on fire. Did we, did we lose all our stuff? We did not lose our stuff. That's surprising. But we are gonna end here for the night, guys. Because I feel like, I feel like this is a, a good spot. Right at the right at the start of chapter three. It's about it's about that time. You know? This is this is a brand new area. New new chapter. Yeah, we just we just beat chapter two. So this is um this is the start of chapter three. So we're gonna we're gonna save. I turned to title. Good good progress tonight, yeah! Yeah, yeah, we made some we made some good progress. And now we get to listen to the fun menu music. Um, let's get comfy though, guys, and I'll find somewhere somewhere to send you. How many chapters? I don't know actually. At least three. <laughs> it seems like there are at least three chapters. But beyond that, I honestly have no idea. Oh. 
But guys, thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. There's the social stuff you guys can normally discover from my Instagram and Twitter and YouTube. Um, I will be back on Monday, Tuesday, Tuesday, Sunday, Monday, t Tuesday. <laughs> I'll be back on Tuesday, guys. And um, we will probably, maybe, possibly start Mass Effect 3 on Tuesday. Um, TP, have a fun vacation. Oh man, I'm jealous. It's gonna be amazing. Um, have fun. Just na just naming days, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll either play this or Mass Effect 3 on Tuesday. We will play more of this. I do kind of want to finish this, because it's really cool. Um, I'm really enjoying it. Uh, hi Jade! Hope you're doing well, but guys, thank you as always for hanging out and being comfy with me. I truly appreciate it. Thanks for the resubs and the bits and the donations. It's very, very kind. Um, all the support means a lot. I will be back in two days. And uh, we'll do fun stuff. Um, go say hi to Thundee. Tell him I went to go make dumplings. Not a lie. That is actually what I'm doing. <laughs> he probably won't believe you. But that is what I'm doing. <laughs> so guys, thank you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna cook them. Yeah, I'm not making them from scratch. I am gonna cook them though. Um. Yeah. Bye, guys. Thanks for hanging out. Love you guys. Bye, bye, bye. Appreciate you. Go say hi to Thandi.